find the standard deviation of the following data 5347. Before going to calculation, you should understand there are two formulas for standard deviation. That is, these are two formulas. Now, there is only one difference between these two formulas. That is, in the first case, you should use n in the denominator and in the second case, you should use n minus 1 in the denominator. If you have data of whole population, you should use n in the denominator. If you don't have data of whole population, then you should use n minus 1 in the denominator. Now, we can calculate the standard deviation of the given samples 5, 3, 4, 7. Here, number of samples is equal to 4 and now calculate the mean of the given sample. Mean means average of the given samples which is 5 plus 3 plus 4 plus 7 is 19 and total numbers are 4. So, 19 by 4 is average. Now, take the difference between each of the given sample and the mean of the given sample then square it. That is here 5 minus 19 by 4. Take the difference. Then take the square of it which is equal to 4 into 5 is 20, 20 minus 19 1. So 1 by 4 square is equal to 1 by 16. Same way 3 minus 19 by 4 then square it. 3 into 4 12, 12 minus 19 7. So 7 by 4 square is equal to 7 square is 49, 4 square is 16. Now again 4 minus 19 by 4 the whole square is equal to 4 into 4 16, 16 minus 19 is 3. 3 by 4 the whole square is 9 by 16. Again 7 minus 19 by 4 the whole square. 4 into 7 28, 28 minus 19 is equal to 9. So 9 by 4 the whole square is equal to 81 by 16. Now take the sum of all this terms which is equal to 1 plus 49, 50, 9 plus 81, 90. So, 90 plus 50 is 140. In denominator, you have 16. So, sum is equal to 140 by 16. So, here, standard deviation formula is equal to square root of sum of square of difference between each of the given sample and mean of the given sample divided by total number of samples that is standard deviation of given sample is equal to square root of sum of square of difference between each of the given sample and mean of the given sample divided by total number of samples. Now this is equal to square root of 140 by 16 divided by n is equal to 4. Now 4 goes 3 times in 12 remaining 23 goes 5 times in 20. So, here I can round off to two decimal places. So, consider root 35 as root 36 which is equal to 6 and here root 16 is 4. Now, this is 3 by 2 which is 1.5. So, your value is around 1.5 means option 1 is your answer that is 1.48 is the standard deviation of 5347.